let's get on with the finale. Eh, the finale, uh, whatchamacallit? The finale medley. Oh, wait, I keep, I keep forgetting. I could also. Hold on. I'm not gonna have uh, her as the lead. I wanna swap to. Luca doesn't have. Uh, wait, hold on. Who has more? Luca or Rin? Did I? Oh, fuck, I keep forgetting. Oh my god. I keep pressing circle thing, you'll just go back to this screen when in actuality it goes back to the song select screen, which is stupid, but whatever. Okay. Four. It seems like it doesn't matter. I want a lot more stuff for Rin, so, uh, more stuff for Luca, so let's swap her for the lead. Yeah, okay, yeah, okay. Switch her up. So this is Luca here. I got Blossom. It looks more elegant than cool, but okay. Uh... Wait, what? Oh, that was a gas mask. <laughs> that's, uh... I don't see how that's cool combined with that outfit, but uh, well, whatever. It's gonna make for an interesting thumbnail, I, I assure you. In fact, why not have everyone have a gas mask just to make it painted black? Whoa, is that like... Okay, do I have another black costume that I'll... That, uh... No. Okay, that doesn't count for the paint to black bonus, but okay. Uh, if I'm gonna give her a mask, I think it's a lot more appropriate to have everyone else in a mask as well. Plus, it'll help in case there's like a a poisonous gas on stage. Although I'm not sure exactly why that would be the case. I like sunflower better in terms of coolness, so let's have that. They could be like a, some sort of satanic heavy metal band with their gas mask or something. They could be like, not really satanic, but Five Fingered Punch Death. I forgot what the band name is called, God damn it. Oh well, whatever. And for Miku, really the only costume she has that's cool is the cheerleader outfit, right? Yeah, oh no, she has White Eve. Oh, that's actually pretty cool with yeah, the different eyes. I'm not sure if the dress is necessarily cool, but... I kind of like that better than the uh, American cheerleader. Plus, it kind of gives her like that mysterious look combined with the gas mask and the different colored eyes. I think I'll go over this one. All right. Now, with that said, let's go into the cool concert hall and play the cool melody, Cyber Rock Jam. Oh, so it's gonna be a lot more futuristic-y or something, right? Okay, let's do this. I call this one the Three Stooges. Unhappy refrain? Oh shit, alright! It seems like they were reusing a lot of uh, song assets from the previous game as well. Although, this is a different alternative version to it, but regardless, it sounds cool. I don't know the lyrics, sorry. Although personally I do like the rock version better instead of the electronic version, but oh well. You can take what you get. Music's changing, oh joy. Oh 
fuck already. Oh, it's Head Goku! Oh! Oh shit, this sounds like Toho. That's gonna be hard, right? Holy shit, I just got the perfect sight read. Oh my god, that was scary. Like, I was like, I really didn't want to talk, but at the same time, I felt like I had to, like, talk, give me, come, my, yeah, give out my commentary. Okay, first off, I unlocked that costume way too fast early in the song, but whatever. That's beside the point. Secondly, I will say my slight criticism towards this song is that it doesn't sound as good as the original version, at least in terms of Tengaku and Unhappy Refrain, but I don't care. It still, it sounds, those songs are very good in, to begin with. I don't think you could really, like, perfect them even further. And it's, it's really nice to hear them in this game, despite the fact, even if it's a different alternative, like, techno version. Does that... Secondly, it doesn't really seem like this is, uh... I mean, I guess it's cybernetic and techno-like, which is true to the title, but it doesn't sound like a whole lot of rock at all, but whatever, that's beside the point. Uh, this one's not that bad. I, I enjoyed this cool medley. But yeah, oh my god, I just got that sight read FC, it was like, oh my god. I was really scared, like, I was scared that I fucked I might fuck up when I talk. But, wow, okay. Okay. That's a good achievement. I think that's a good achievement to end on, if this is the final song. Okay, last cutscene. Ugh. The cloud prism is dazzling when it's fully charged. We produce so much voltage, I think I hear the fuse blow backstage. We made history with that gig! Miku, you have some mad drum skills. Although, to be fair, if we're talking about like bass, guitar, and drum skills. They, those were pretty basic. <laughs> basic instrumentals. They didn't sound like as good as like when, when Luca was trying to imitate Flea from Red Hot Chili Peppers, but... Mm, whatever. You maintain the rhythm like a professional drummer. Thanks. It was a cinch to stay on track while you play next to me. Rocking and rolling as a band was fantastic. Mm -hmm. Collaborating with you all is all, that, all always a lot more fun. It made my day. Rock and roll hall of fame. Here we come. We should all do this again sometime. Thanks to you, I think we all feel a little a, a little cooler. Now on to the next. Concert? Even though this is the last concert of the, uh, okay. There's probably more to it than that, right? Oh, look! Light has returned to all five prisms. We've successfully performed all the songs from each cloud. Ah, sorry. It's nothing. The clouds are, and their music have taught us new ways of expressing ourselves in our new songs. Uh, ooh, excuse me. Sorry about that. And we built up enough voltage through our performances to bring the prism back to their full brightness. It's been a long journey, and you've been there helping us every step of the way. 
but the show must go on, and Epic Adventure needs the grand finale! Let's hold another festival? Okay. We'll use everything we've learned to make a best show in the world. That's the spirit! It's bound to be a resounding success! Let's get everything ready. I'm really looking forward to this special festival. Alright, the ultimate festival. So I'm guessing this is how we progress through the story with the final festival, and that's the entire song list? Oh, that's the case. That kind of sucks, because it feels like the song list is very tiny, especially the fact that only one Kaito song? Really? Uh, okay, whatever. Uh, let's see here. Rare guaranteed tiger cattail. I guess that's the unlock, the, uh, costume with a module that we're gonna unlock. Amazing Festival, once again, put on a show of a lifetime. Concert halls only. Okay. So, three songs. I'm guessing this could be any songs. Alright, so I guess I should go for my top three from number three first to number one. I, I guess as like a, a certain finale to the song, uh, to the LP. Let's see. <laughs> this has to be on it. Underhand Rangers. I absolutely love that song, but at the same time, I don't want to overplay it too much. Uh, I think you guys already know that's my probably my best song I played. Actually, no, we should probably play songs that we have not played in a festival yet. So, Underhand Rangers, unfortunately, is out of the question. ID is out of the question. I think Amazing Dulce is also out of the question as well. I don't think I played Holy Lance Explosion Boy. And I like that song. Uh, I played Love Triangle. Fuck, what was that? What was that Rin song called? Name of the Sin? Okay, hold on. I want to start something real quickly at the Cool Prism. I just want to check what the the song that goes. Called. And I remember that was a Rin song. Lost One's Weeping? Was that it? Or was it Calc? No, I, th I don't think it was Calc. I think it was The Lost One's Weeping. Either that or Strange. I don't fucking know. I think it is The Lost One's Weeping. Alright, I'm gonna go with that one. That's only assuming. If not, then okay, whatever. Oops. Okay. Let's go for that one. Second song. Wait, I could... Okay, never mind. You can't choose the same song twice. All right. Huh. So, are, are those two the hardest songs? Babylon and... Okay. What are the songs I like again? That I have not played yet? This is not the so same song I'm thinking of, is it? No. Holy Lance Explosion Boy and... What else was a lot very very much memorable that I haven't played yet? I think I played Love Triangle already. Was Patchwork Staccato one of them? I uh Yeah, this song doesn't really have a whole lot of memorabilia besides the songs that I already mentioned beforehand. So let's just go for not this one. We can't play the song ever again, unfortunately. Even if I do like the song, it's flag for copyright, so there's that. No, fuck, I'm gonna go for Strangers just in case because I don't know if that's the case, but uh, we got two cools and I think one elegant. So let's go for a cool concert hall. This one is for Rin. Yoshi. Did she just say Yoshi? <laughs> Should we have the return of the gas girls again? <laughs> Why the fuck not? Okay. This should give us a lot of voltage bonus. The shit? Oh, whoa, this is for the second time. Okay. Uh, derp. Um. Oh, she doesn't. He doesn't have a cool outfit, though. Let's have Santa pelvic thrusting. <laughs> Why not? More gas mask. Why not? And oh, our harmonica. Okay, I guess that's considered cool. Why not? And last song, Miku.
I really need to take Japanese class again just to understand what the fuck they're saying. What does Yano mean again? I'm pretty sure someone in the comment section will tell me. Who knows? Alright. I think we got everything that we need. So let's do this. And again, the last one. Oh, so that means Miku is going to be the one that's unlocked the costume. Despite the fact that we have plenty of Miku songs already. With uh, the costume. Oh, well, whatever. Okay. Festival start! Alright. Yeah, this is the one I'm thinking of. Yeah, she is very brash and unapologetic to that mic stand. Okay. So much for that perfect. That's a very nice guitar riff. I really can't wait to play most of these songs on Experts just to see how difficult they are. Alright, here we go! Alright, I forgot this song had an awesome bass line. I'm a huge sucker for bass, uh, for fantastic bass lines, you can tell, right? Oh my god, that that last bit was really uh, confusing a little bit. Con different timing and all that shit. Alright, this song doesn't seem that bad.
Oh, that was terrible. Princess, why not? Is that the Cantarella outfit? Or is that the Speak outfit? I forgot. Seems like they were using a lot of costumes from the old games as well, from what I noticed. Alright, perfect. Oh, not perfect, but perfectly, well, time for a finale, I guess. Yeah, definitely pass through that. Enhances rate up note effect by 3%. Okay. I keep forgetting all these costumes also have different abilities as well that I never really noticed, honestly. So, that's that, right? Or is there more to it? That music festival was incredible. The songs, modules, and stage you chose for us? Everything fits together perfectly! Hey, um, you may have noticed I've been preoccupied lately. Well, we've completely restored all five clouds, right? But it doesn't quite feel like the end yet. Oh, okay, so there's gotta be more songs, right? Something tells me we're miss still missing something. More Kaito songs? Maybe we haven't found all the songs? Maybe you just want to sing more? Yeah, let's go for this one. Wait, you mean there could be more songs? That must be it! A final song. But I wonder where it could be. We've definitely checked all the clouds from top to bottom. Oh. Huh? Something's happening to the prisms! What in the world? What are those things? Looks like they're just popped out of the prisms. Let's go take a closer look. Okay. This should be interesting. The voltage that's been accumulated in the cloud prism has been crystallized into... Well, a crystal. <laughs> mm. That accumulated voltage then triggers a reaction, which increases the pressure. And I guess that's what caused the crystal to pop out. See? Take a look. They're empty. The voltage that filled them has completely solidified into these crystals. Wow, Kaito, you sure know a lot about this. What will happen if we go back to recharge those clouds? Well, I assume the prism would produce more crystals. Hmm, I just guess, I'm just guessing here, but... Do you think something special might happen if we collect more of those crystals? Will these be more different new songs, or will we have to be playing through the songs again? just to grind for these crystals. If that's the case, that seems really annoying to do. Maybe we'd unlock the final hidden song. Think it's possible? Wait a second, what's this talking about a final song? <laughs> there might be. We were just saying earlier that... Flashback to five okay. minutes away. Interesting, you might have the answer something here. Then let's get singing, folks. We've got to charge all these prisms again. Please tell me we don't have to replay through the songs again. If At best, maybe play through a higher difficulty. You sure look happy, Miku. By the way, I've got an idea I think you'll all enjoy. Once we've collected, uh, collected crystals from each of the prisms, what do you say we hold another festival? For each prism? Oh, God, okay. <laughs> Excuse me. Crystals are a sign that we've pr proven ourselves the, the five clouds, right? They're like the prism seals of approval. Maybe they're giving us a blessing of a real big show, like another festival. <laughs> Count me in, I'd, say, I'd never say no to a <laughs> festival. Sounds like we've got a new goal. Better get to work. I'm always ready to sing. 
Okay, let me look at these crystals real quickly to see if they're new songs or if they're repeating songs. Also, yeah, trophy! Okay. You can now collect cloud voltage. Voltage will accumulate based on your score. Congratulations, the cloud voltage system has been updated. From now on, when you build up enough voltage in the cloud, you'll get a nice shiny crystal. <laughs> okay. Collecting crystals will unlock requests, where you might get special modules. When you gather a crystal from each of the five clouds you can hold a festival, you'll have, have, you have a better chance of scoring rare modules from a festival. Okay. You can see how much voltage you build up and the crystals you've collected in the cloud section screen or in each cloud. From here on out, your performances will directly influence how much voltage- Okay, so here, it is very necessary to build up more voltage just to grind out these uh, points more often. Do better in the rhythm game and you get more sweet voltage. Pull off great performances to build up voltage in the clouds. Yep, here. Okay, so... Seems like we need at least 900,000 for each voltage. And I'm guessing we still play- Oh, fuck! We're gonna have to grind through these again? Just to unlock more new songs? Alright, hold on. Wait a minute. Can I at least play on Hard or Expert? Oh, thank god, you can actually play on Expert this time! Fuck yeah! Okay, good. Alright. Although, at the same time, I kinda wanna- No, 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 no. I should- No, no, never mind. I should unlock all the songs before I... Get to the uh, lyrical analysis. But holy shit, yes! I finally get to play on Extreme Mode, so that's gonna be a good- Good time to uh, take a quick break, um, and uh, assuming we could go into any order we want to. And I'm gonna guess that we're gonna have to play through every single song, right? Oh boy, okay, let's get the fucking shit one out of the way then. <laughs> so we'll be right back, and stay tuned for our next episode, and it's probably gonna- the next episode will probably get as many dislikes as whatever, because I hate this one. But whatever, alright, be right back. <laughs> 